Hey, hey, happy people. Happy people. <laughs> yeah. All of y'all. Today we have happy and we are going to be making a lobster bisque. And I miss y'all. You said <laughs> not, lobster bisque? Yes, not only are we making a lobster bisque, but we're going to make it vegan lobster bisque. And not only are we going to make it vegan, we're going to make it alkaline. No, just uh, <laughs> I got it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna make an alkaline version. But to get started, first we do make to make our cream for the uh, soup here. So first we're gonna start out with our blender here, and we got some nuts here. We have this is one whole cup altogether, but we have half and half. We have a half cup of Brazil nuts, and we have a half cup of walnuts in here. Okay. This is an expensive nut mix right here. Brazilian nuts. Well, that's why you cut down on the Brazil nuts by using some walnuts and Brazil nuts together. All right. Yeah. Now you have uh, you got some white spelt flour and some kelp powder. That's going to kind of give us this ocean mm. flavor. Kelp flour. Kelp powder. Kelp powder. I, I won't remember that in five minutes. No. <laughs> All right, and then you got some veggie broth here. This is one cup of veggie broth. We do have some waiting in the wings here, just in case you need more. You might need more. Just depends on your nuts and how long you soak. Our nuts did. <laughs> our nuts did soak. Soak overnight. Nuts, now. <laughs> overnight. <laughs> All right, so now you're gonna put the top on it, honey. We're gonna blend it up here. See if we need to add any more broth to it. What you wanna do? Alright, so you're gonna start with high. Just go ahead because we're gonna try to put this one. High. Oh, okay. Alright, so you see how you still got quite a few yeah. chunks in there? So now you're gonna add some more veggie broth, just a little bit at a time. Don't dump the whole thing in there. Oh. That ain't no fun. <laughs> just put some in there. See, I told you, spilling. Alright. She like me to spill. Alright, and do it again there. Uh-huh. Yep. Alright, so cover this a little bit more. We want to get as creamy as we can get. She sets me up to spill shit, you know. Nah. I'll put that top back on. I did that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, All right, so take the top off, scrape the little edges there around there. there. So, yeah. So that way, all that at the top there get mixed in too. Alright, so that is how you make your cream for this. So now we're going to change out the table here because we need to put the little eye up here. So give us just a minute. Honey, yeah. you want to do your movie magic? I think I do. You ready? Go Let's go! Up. Wow. <laughs> and we're back. <laughs> we're back. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> we got our Dutch oven here today and we are now going to start our soup here. So, honey, I have already turned on your uh, okay. heat there, but you do have some oil here. This is avocado oil today. You need to pour that in there so we can get that all heated up. Yes, sir. All of it. I don't know if they can see in that pot. <laughs> I think they can. Or they probably can. I didn't check. <laughs> I hope they can. Alright, so we're going to let that heat up really quickly here. Can y'all see that? It should heat up quickly. You're seeing a shimmer. A what? A shimmer. No. I don't All know right, what but. that means. That's cooking times. <laughs> we have here, uh, we're going to start off with our uh, fennel. This is the fennel bulb. I did not use the uh, stalks or the uh, little fringes this time, just the bulb alone. Fennel bulbs. And as you know, you already need to cook that first because it is a little tougher than celery and then the rest. You can go ahead and pour it in there. Okay. 
a little tougher than your celery and your um, butternut squash uh, that you would usually use in this, your celery, so you want to cook that first, so that way use this, it will be a little softer. Yeah. Use this? Yes. Oh, okay. And I suggest all cooks get some of these. Most, every cook has those. Oh, know. dang. Anyway. I am late. Oops. And you said just let it do its thing, right? Well, stir it around so it can so it's getting tender. Can't believe y'all got me back here for another one. Another one. You know I miss y'all. <laughs> right, let it go right. Feel them softening up around the edges? No, I wasn't feeling it. I was trying to brown them and shit. I'm I was trying to do brown them <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> you want to feel them? No. Oh, it's ready. You think so? <laughs> Are you just saying? You no, know, I was just saying that boy is about to smell that. You smell them. They're releasing their aroma. Yes, they are. All right, so now we're going to go with our butternut squash here. Uh, you want? You said make sure they tender though, right? This is still kind of hard. Yeah. Okay. But it's browning though. Yeah, that's why you want to keep stirring them around so they're getting the heat around mm. sticking long enough to burn. Mm, no saute. I can't saute them, y'all. <laughs> What's the difference in sauteing and doing what you're doing right now? What? Spinning them. It won't be <laughs> on, uh, so what is sauteing to you? Well, I uh, burn each side of the vegetable. Okay, that's not sauteing. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, Trevor. When I eat it, yeah. I'll put like onions and some grease. Whatever I add, maybe it's mushrooms and stuff like that. And then I... Get them all the way down where it got there. Okay. I don't cook. Okay. <laughs> what you think? Alright, I think you're good. You can go ahead and start putting in your butternut squash here. Spoon and uh, got some shallots here. Butternut squash. All of it? No, just a little bit. Okay, there you go. Nice. <laughs> Oh, love it. Alright, you got your salad. Yeah. Spin them. Stir them. <laughs> got some shallots for you. Even though I thought that them was onions at first. They are part of the onion family. There you go, baby. Alright, now you got some not so minced garlic here. Can you get that? MrStayHappy.com. And where can we reach that at? MrStayHappy.com. <laughs> That's M R S T double H A P P Y. It ain't got two A's and two P's, it ain't me. But y'all better get this on this my favorite. <laughs> Don't want to waste that. So I'm shaking it, just take your spoon out. Oh, okay. Take your spoon and scrape it out. <laughs> oh, okay. I got that. I was just checking the uh, squash right there that was on the side of my wall in there. Mm. Oh, man, this smells awesome, y'all. <laughs> you know, the million subscribers. <laughs> you know I'm talking crazy, y'all. When we get up to a hundred thousand, I'm gonna be trying to hunt to y'all house and try to like, cook something. It is forever <laughs> trying to get in y'all house. <laughs> now you can kind of lay them, uh, layer them across the bottom of the pan there, so they all get some good heat there. Start softening up again. 
in the words of my people, dude. Watch this, y'all. Uh, I, 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 Alright, so we're gonna let those saute down a little bit and we'll be right back. Well, actually, those was in my words. Watch All right. Hey! <laughs> yeah. Alright, so now we've let our uh, vegetables here soften up a little bit. So now you're gonna add Smell your tomato good. paste here. This is alkaline tomato paste. Mr. Stayhappy.com. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> yeah. Gotta get all this so you know this is gonna make me taste even better. <laughs> Let me just say it regular. Bye. Nah, we make our own tomato paste so we know it's made with nothing but the aroma tomatoes. So yes. So mix it. Because they like to use a lot of those beef steak tomatoes and stuff like that because that produces more, but no. We make our own. Yes. These ain't real tomatoes. Get a rope. No, I'm just playing. Okay. <laughs> Get a rope. Alright, now. We are going to substitute the white wine that usually would be put into this. And as you guys know, I've said before, this is basically some veggie broth, some agave, some key lime juice, and sea salt together there. I promise I'm going to make a video on just showing you how to make this. So you'll have it available for yourself. Yes. <laughs> but to substitute the white wine right now. Yes. So don't drink this trying to get buzz in this. No. Do not drink that. It's pretty much cooking wine. All of it? No. Put all of it in Oh. <laughs> I never made this before. <laughs> oh, yeah. My bad. All of it. I know that. No. <laughs> all right. Now the sizzle done disappeared. Yeah. Evaporated. But it smells so good. Alright, we're going to uh, turn the heat up here for ourselves and let this come up to a little uh, bubble here before we start adding more ingredients. And remember, don't put your head over the pot because the smell make your mouth water. You don't want it drip, <laughs> drip, dripped all in your drink. Drip all in your Alright, we're back. It is boiling as you guys can see. So now Happy is going to add our veggie broth. <laughs> add the veggie broth. I'm going to add the veggie broth. How much is it? That is four cups. Don't want to spill that on you. All right. Hot. There you go. And... I better go take y'all south, man. We got a lot of You got a bay leaf. One whole bay leaf there. What does this do again? It is flavor. It releases its aroma. <laughs> and it's good for you. Bay's, bay leaves are good for okay, you. Okay. Alright, so now you have some seasonings here and we have some uh, smoked sea salt, some annatto, some cayenne, some alkaline black pepper, some alkaline nutritional yeast, and some alkaline ocean catch seasoning. Dang, where you get most of these from? Most of those came from MrStrayHappy.com. <laughs> well, look at y'all. <laughs> That's M R S T W A Y H A P P Y. No two A's and no two B's. Then it ain't we. See? Oh, let me show everybody. I want to be. We're putting all this in here. Yes, all of that. Oh, this is going to be this. Oh, the smell's going to be. I'm going to use that for this, right? Oh, I'm supposed to spill it at the end of the day. She got a deal with me, y'all. Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right, yes, baby. I do. All right, get yourself all stirred up there, honey. Get that off of that one. Don't want to waste nothing. You can take that now I use my spoon. So I'm going to mix all that. <laughs> Boy, I'm glad they didn't have this when we was kids. 
Some of y'all would have got a fat knuckle. Bow! Get out there, get you. <laughs> Alright, alright. So now. Oh, man, it smells awesome. You know what this smell like? What's oil. That? Oh my god, the seafood oil? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, now we're ready. Alright, so now we're going to wait for this to come up to a boil again. And then we're going to add our cream here. We're almost done. And a couple more steps. Well, okay, so a few two, more steps. Okay, so two boils, that's almost a big bunion on there, huh? Hot boy? <laughs> 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 Alright, so now. You know what time you know what lime it is, now. You know what lime it is? <laughs> Alright, so it's come to a boil, honey, so now okay. you're gonna add your cream in there. Okay. Mm. All of it? All of it. Alright, we're gonna cook. <laughs> Cream it out, cream it out, look. Ooh, don't spit it, but she's not. I mean, so. As y'all see, it's not boiling right now. <laughs> mm. And I keep everything in one container without the so. table involved. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I think we did. Good? Yeah. Can I dip that? Dip that. You want to dip that so you would clean that stuff, <laughs> the rest off. Let's dip that over. And you can all taste right. it. Yep. Delicious. It in there. Delicious. That was good. Mm. Y'all have got to taste this. So we're going to taste it for you. <laughs> Make sure it don't stick right. Alright, we gotta let it come back to a boil. We're gonna but, let it boil one more time. Alright, so now, these one more are. Line. Oh, <laughs> these are lobster mushrooms. This is what we're gonna use to replace our mushroom uh, lobster. These were dried in the beginning, they were measured while they were dry. dry. Two cups of dried lobster mushrooms, then we rinsed them off. And soak them here in this water, uh, spring water for about, it's been about four hours now. So, we're going to add these to the dish too. So, honey, you're going to try to scoop them out. Try not to use too much of the liquid. It's okay if you get some in there because that's fine. It's just more flavoring. But we don't want it to be too soupy. Okay, okay. If it gets too thick, then we'll use the rest to thin it out. Okay. Some more things I'm going to spill. The I'll juice. Over the, there you go. Okay. You don't want me to get no tongs or nothing? You think you'd be better with tongs? Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's boiling, so I need to hurry up. Oh, I see why you got this for me, so it won't make you juicy. And you know the crazy thing? I used to never even like seafood. See, you don't want to put too much uh, of the juice in there now. <laughs> Go ahead, Mr. Chef. I've been doing, doing this for chef. years, man. For years, <laughs> man. <laughs> mm. For all you seafood lovers, y'all, I'm going to eat this for y'all. Mm. This is real good. Well, they can make their own at home now. Yeah, y'all can, but you need that seasoning. <laughs> it ain't going to taste the same. See, I did it good. Let me shut up. Let me finish. Let me finish. Uh, All right. I did a good job. I just, I haven't spilled that. Spin. Yep. Spin it. Spin it. I am not liking the color, so I think we're gonna add some more natto powder to this. Well, it's usually like a lobster bisque is usually kind of red. Oh, okay. She know better than I do. <laughs> it look good. Mmm. <laughs> All right. So, got some uh, more natto powder. We're gonna add that because I do want to get a red color to this. Red color. Okay. 
Kansas City Chiefs trade. Uh oh. <laughs> be quiet. Let me be quiet. All of you, right? Too late. Yeah. Too late. Yeah. Too late. You're good. There we go. We're gonna mix all that in there, make it look a little, little red, like she said. Yeah, get some more color in there. Oh man, it smells good. Alright, so now what we're gonna do is let this cook here. We're gonna let this go probably for about I'm gonna say ten minutes and we're gonna check it. We're gonna put the uh top on it here. Oh. We're gonna try to get them edges. All right, so now, we're just gonna cover this, let it go for about 10 minutes here, see how it's going here. See how my color come along. I'm gonna take this lid and put it on top. Yes. Oh, I didn't spill that, that was awesome. <laughs> All right, so, about 10 minutes. Y'all ready? Let's go. All right. What? All right, so we're back, it's been about, uh, Mm. Uh, seven minutes here, not quite ten minutes. It's boiling pretty good. Forever. It smells like forever, I promise y'all. <laughs> Alright, let's so now. drink. This will be hot, so we want to sit that over there. <laughs> oh, no, Alright, so, honey, we're going to give you a good stir around here. Okay. We probably want to cut down our heat here okay. at this moment. What about that leaf? Leave it in there? You can leave the leaf in there. Well, if you feel, don't feel comfortable, you can take it out. No, I'm just saying, I don't want to, <laughs> whatever happens, if it's gone in the mix, it's gone in the mix. Alright, so now, we have one of Happy's favorite tools. <laughs> we are using the Immersion Blender today, the Stick Blender. And it's a Tiffany color. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, baby. Alright, so you're going to blend some of this. We're not going to do all of it. We don't want to completely smooth. But okay. We do want some of the be blended in so the mushroom flavor will be blended into the uh, broth. Okay. All right. What so she said. Y'all watching? Give All it right. a go. Oh, down a little bit. Go down. Don't come out of the liquid. This is very dangerous, I Just see. Move it around. Go up and down, Jim. Move it around. Very dangerous, <laughs> in my opinion. One of Happy's favorite tools. No. Are you ready? You can set that down right there. That's it. I mean, ooh. <laughs> that right, stuff is right hot. Here. Okay. Did I get it? I, I see some good, good chunks in there, though. Well, you can still have larger chunks. You just want to get some of them blended, blitzed uh, up there. Well, that bad boy put on a warp speed like I thought it was going to take me <laughs> out of here, y'all. You going in the mix with us. No, All right, we're just going to let that come back to a nice little boy there. Okay. It'll come up pretty quickly here. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to sit this over here. You said put the lid on it or no? You know what? Taste it. See how you like it. Okay. Ooh Don't worry, I'm gonna wash the spoon off. I ain't gonna do y'all like that. But you know I only eat seafood. But this tastes good. This is my favorite. And I put a stamp on that. <laughs> I stay happy on that. Alright, we're just going to just come back to a boil I'll here. I'll be right back. <laughs> Can we put the lid on? No, we're going to leave it just like that and we're to come back to a boil. Okay. Be right back. Back. Alright. So, now, it has come to a boil again, so now we're going to turn off the heat because we're totally done. And I'll wipe the spoon. <laughs> Alright, turn the heat down. Yes. 
Yes. Alright, we are totally done. So now, honey, you can spoon us a little bit in this bowls here. Mm, mm, mm. This is hot. Yes, I'm it is. Scared. He's scared. I'm scared. Alright. You want a lot? You want a good chunk in there? You want a yeah. piece of lobster up in there? Alka lobster. Alka lobster. That's my thing, man. I told you I could still be messing it up. <laughs> right, let's try this again. This is very hot. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. I did. Alright. Let me take a picture of that one right there. You want a picture of that one? Yeah, take a picture of that one. <laughs> you proud of yourself, sir? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Oh, okay. Lobster bisque. <laughs> oh, so I didn't even finish this. Oh. I don't know. Mm. He did have it all over. He was doing, uh, pouring all the stuff in there. Yeah, it went dead. Alright, cut okay. that out. But anyway, you got that picture? Well, I take pictures over here too. Oh, whatever. Move that. Hold up. There you go. Get that sidebar on there. You got the boil in there too. <laughs> Let me pull up some of that wisdom out so you can see that too. Whatever. See it? I should not move off. I'm getting good pictures here. Oh, yeah. You want Sorry, y'all. He forgot to cut the camera back on. <laughs> no, the camera is big. The battery is big. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See it? No, baby, it's gone. You forgot to charge it up. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, y'all forgot to charge the camera up, man. It's gone, so take a look at the pictures. Some lucky people might get to try this, but right now it's gonna be us. <laughs> and I'm gonna try it for all of y'all, okay? All right, watch the biscuit. It's warm. Oh, yes, it is. He's sad, my wife be holding this like nothing. Hold it at the top where it's not at. Okay, this is good. This is good. It's just hot, boy. It is really good. <laughs> it do taste like lobster. Oh, this is awesome. Yeah. It really is. Okay, y'all gotta make this one. Tell me in the comments what you think of it. Was it good? Did you change anything? Did you like it? If you didn't like it, why didn't you like it? You know, tell me something. Please like, subscribe, and share. Y'all better share this. Oh, this is good. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I okay. better get them seasonings on there too. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> all right. Um, go to MrJHappy.com to get all the seasonings that you saw us use today. 
Um, what else? Share, like, subscribe, like. And hit the ding, 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 